Staying home more means we're eating at home more and spending more money at the grocery store and prices are expected to go up. The USDA predicts an increase of about 3% this year, but there are some ways you can start saving money on your grocery bill. Now we talked to the experts at N26 who gave us five tips. First, when it comes to fruits and vegetables, buy what's in season. It will taste better and save you money. Also, try store brands. The quality is usually just as good. Shop frequently. It may sound counterintuitive, but regular visits can help keep you from overbuying in one big trip. And pay attention to your expenses, save your receipt, then actually go back and look at it. Look to see where you're spending your money. Where do you think maybe you spent a little bit too much and it was wasted? It's really interesting to look at a receipt a week or two weeks after you took that grocery trip and said, okay, well, whatever happened to this, we never made that recipe that we said we were going to. Pay attention to those things. And finally, start small. Even if you start by using just one of these tips, it can save you money in the long run. We'll have more money saving advice from Amy throughout the show. And Will, one thing that people are also weighing is whether they want to save money or save time. So instead, maybe they just go to one store instead of multiple stores. Yeah, both of those are huge right now because a lot more people are cooking from home and making things at home, thus buying more groceries. So it really becomes one or the other there, Danielle. Thanks so much.